Hello, my name is Simone Plout. I'm a Chartered Health and Safety Practitioner, a naturopath and nutritionist. And I'm here to talk to you about the new ingredient that's being added to our milk and dairy products called Bovea. The scientific name for this chemical is actually 3-nitro-oxypropanol and it is a synthetic ingredient which is being added to cow feed in order to prevent them making as much methane gas as they would normally make. So it's interfering with their ruminant, that's the multiple stomachs that they have within their digestive system and interfering with that normal function in order to apparently reduce the methane gas according to climate advisors causing problems and anthropogenic climate change. But there are many people with strong scientific backgrounds arguing against this particular theme and saying that this is all a nonsense. So I'm not here to argue on that point. I am here to tell you about what the risks are of this particular substance. Now I know by reading the material safety data sheet for this material that it reduces the size of cow ovaries and it reduces the size of cow heart muscle. That is not good for cows. So it may reduce the methane gas output, but it's certainly not good for the cows that are eating it. And so what is that then gonna be doing to humans who are gonna be drinking that milk? And where is it gonna find its way? It's gonna find its way into dairy, into cheese, into cream, into a whole host of things. But more sinister of all, it's gonna find its way into baby milk formula because that is made of cow's milk. And that is something to be very concerned about indeed. There are other alternatives. I did find in my uh, literature search that there are derivatives of uh, pine cones that can be used to reduce methane gas in cow, ruminant cow, digestive systems, so that's not the only show in town. And also, what tests have been done to find out whether it's finding its way into our dairy food and into our milk. It's being trialled by various supermarkets, including Tesco and uh, Morrison's, and Marks and Spencer's are all trialling it and it is something of great concern to me. I certainly won't be eating anything that could be contaminated with this ingredient because I don't know what it's going to do to my digestive system and interfering with methane gas production could be interfering with normal gut flora action and life cycle of the bacteria in normal gut. So who knows? All I do know is that we're being experimented on yet again by people who have far more interest in their profit margins than they do about my safety. And so I am avoiding that stuff. I'm going directly to farmers markets to get my dairy foods and I'm avoiding anything that could be contaminated by this product. Thank you for listening and please do look into what's going on Bovea or 3-nitro-oxypropanol is being used as an experimental additive for cow uh, feed and it could well be getting into our dairy foods. I don't want to be eating it, do you?